So a big debate that I've had since video one, honestly, in my head, and I really haven't discussed it too much with you guys, is I don't know whether I should westernize or not. Because I'm Eastern technology, there really isn't a reason to, but that that's that strategy was kind of more post-Art of War. That's kind of a, a post, or I'm sorry, a pre-Art uh, Art of War sort of strategy. But now, I, I'm not sure. I know that Eastern and Western technology, there's not that much of a difference. Um, I, and it costs a lot to westernize, so I, I just don't know. I mean, I don't really plan on westernizing anytime soon, at least I don't think so. I mean, my strategy could definitely change, like, on a dime, but uh, currently I can't because we are uh, overextended, but it, it's gonna, it costs you a lot. I mean, we've, if you've been watching the Mayan campaign, when you watched me westernize a few weeks ago, it was, it was devastating. It's hard, you know, and, and we actually got pretty damn lucky. Uh, I've been through a westernization process where it, you get, you know, you can get really, really crappy luck and uh, and it's it's really hard to kind of stable out your empire as you're beginning to westernize. I don't know if I, if I really want to. Just because, I mean, the thing about us is that we've got the pure manpower, baby. Like, we've got just so much manpower and that's something that we should just continue investing in, is maybe quantity over quality. But we'll see. I mean, I'm not really planning on uh, deciding on if I want to do that or not for a pretty long time. I've got 8,000 troops coming in to help out my coming to help out my vassal here of uh, Norway. He feels a little bit more, a little bit better towards me. His liberty desire was pretty high before. Now I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm fixing that opinion of, of of us, I guess, between our two nations, and that's kind of lowered it by 44.2. Not bad. Okay, and again, yeah, I'm not playing the whole cardinal game. I'm just going to use my papal influence. Maybe. I'm not sure what I want. We'll see. But I, I want to wait for the good stuff. Some of this stuff is like not, not worth it. Not at all. Okay, so it looks like we're gonna have to take out at least one loan. Not bad, I thought it was gonna be way worse. Oh! Okay. Wait, why is that? Did you change? Okay, I was gonna say. I I, I was wondering if it was because you changed to, uh, to Protestant. Yeah, no, that's not the case. Okay, we've taken out a loan, pretty big loan, but okay, that's fine, we'll pay it back later. Still converting. This is a lot of the reason why also our economy kind of sucks is, you know, these missionaries are costing us how much money per month? Oh, not much. Negative 1.24. That's kind of nothing, but still. Something to keep in mind. Uh, the, uh, please tell me these guys are almost done. Yes. Thank God. Okay, so uh, the Russian patriots might not uprise. If we get lucky enough, they might not uprise. And that would be good. And all this other stuff doesn't really matter. I would like to boost my stability, but we're not really at that point right now. Okay, good. We got there just in time. Oh, those are some pretty big rebels. 4,000 versus 2,000? We got kind of lucky there. Although I'm not sure exactly how the rebels work in uh, Siberia. Yeah, I, I'm not exactly sure. I'm sure they don't work the same way as Africa and 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 uh, the natives from America. Okay, good. So I'll, what I'll do is I'll detach enough to siege and we'll take these guys down. That should make things a little bit better between the two nations. I need to start fabricating another claim on Muscovy. We've gotten claims on just about every kind of uh, country that we want to go. We've, we want to go to war with Sweden, Denmark, and Golden Horde. Uh, but I want to make sure that I completely take out everything Muscovy has. And I don't really care. Let's just go for uh, maybe these guys. I wonder if I took enough so that I can fully annex them next time around. No, I can't. Total war score. Uh... I, I can't. I can't do it. Well, if the Golden, maybe if the Golden Horde do declare war in Muscovy, um, or I don't, I don't. I, if, if the Golden Horde do declare war in Muscovy and they take a few provinces, then that would help me be able to fully annex them the second time around. Which I mean, right now we can't do anything about it, anyways. Unless, of course, we intervene and go to war with the Golden Horde. I do want to take these provinces down here. Oh, Greece. Who is Greece allied to? Nobody that strong. Hey, wait a second. Wait a second. It's a nice, easy war we can get into. And to clean up our borders. That's seriously like my number one priority. I'm not even kidding. Accepted culture loss. Uh, okay. Uh, we could actually vassalize Greece, but that, what's the point of that? I don't. I. I don't really see much of a point in that. So I don't. I don't think I'm gonna do that. Uh, how we doing? How we looking? Okay, at least my national rest is back in the negatives. That's a start. It is back in the negatives. And let me see if I've finished up my exploration. Not yet. We're currently looking for the Hudson Bay. I guess. We don't know where it's at, and we're looking for the Hudson Bay. Okay, tell me this has gone away a little bit. No, no, not really. 
We're still gonna have to fight them. And we're gonna have to, and I, the thing is I wanna decrease the amount of money we're spending right now. Is it, where can I afford? Colonies is kind of messing me up. Hmm. I'm just gonna hopefully use my, my raw, just numbers here to hopefully bail me out of this. I wonder if I, also if I reduce my inflation that might help. Let's go ahead and do that. And I still don't have an error. It's a little bit spooky. It scares the crap out of me because we could definitely get locked into a, uh, well, I mean, I feel strong enough that I can kind of take on anyone, uh, except for maybe Austria and maybe their alliances. I'm sure Austria is allied to a lot of people. I mean, and we're not really allied to that many. Who, what, what line am I from? What, what king? Okay, the line, the Polish, the Polish line. There's no way. Poland doesn't have that many good allies. Denmark, Lithuania. Yeah, no, we'd be fine. I think we could fight both Denmark and, and Poland. That shouldn't be an issue. Oh my gosh, I'm getting so much influence. No wonder I, I'm I'm, a, I'm going for something good. I'm gonna go for something good in this uh, in the papacy. I don't know what it's gonna be. I mean, our legitimacy could be better. Um, we could we could really go for I don't know. We can go for a few things here. All right, so I'm I'm glad that you're doing that. Do we have any possible opportunities of colonization? Technically, no. I'm pretty sure this stuff is still under Terra Incognita. We're gonna have to discover a lot more stuff. Okay, well, let's just just keep on exploring. Keep on exploring. Uh, eventually, we're going to get to the diplomatic technology next level. That's going to, uh, sure enough, I'm sure, uh, Diplotech 9 will, will give us enough to colonize over there. And again, I think, I think to repeat my goal, I, I would say my goal right now for this campaign is to kind of get as far into um, Eastern Asia as I can while also controlling a colony somewhere in North America. That's kind of my goal right now. Oh, of course, we really didn't need that. We did not need that. Great. Okay. Well, whatever. And yeah, like I said, I'm, I'm not going to go to war just yet. I want to stable out my economy. I might need to only send out one colonist at a time. If, if this is, it's kind of ridiculous right now. How much this is costing us. Oh man, Muscovy, you're not doing so well. Okay, these colonists are still taking quite a long time. Global, oh, there it is right there. Golden Horde declared war on Muscovy. All right, well, hmm. The good thing is, we're, I mean, we've got at least a, two, a few provinces protected. I don't know how much the Golden Horde are going to take. We've got to take these guys down. Oh, shit. All right. All right, so, uh, exactly, show me the war. Poland declared war on the Ottomans. Wait a second, bro. Why are you pulling me down into this? Okay, well, it's just us. It's Poland and Lithuania. Okay, I'll accept. I hope the Ottomans don't come towards me, uh, but they might. I'm going to accept this. Okay. The QQ have... Oh, awesome. So the QQ have dishonored their alliance. So the QQ are not going to join in. Again, that was kind of the other... Uh, that was kind of the other nation that I was I was worried about next. And, and my biggest fear right now is if the Golden Horde and the Ottomans uh, make uh, make some sort of declaration of alliance. That would be bad. They, they, have, a, they have a stable relationship right now. 25. I need to go to war with these guys before they, they make some sort of alliance. That would be so bad. That'd be terrible. The Ottomans don't have that many alliances, and neither do the Golden Horde, so I'm sure they're not getting some sort of penalty like uh, too many great powers or whatever it is, whatever that penalty is. All right, so the Russian patriots are coming. I need to boost this back up. Maybe even raise war taxes could be good. I guess while I'm at war, we might as well, right? I can afford this because I'm doing okay in... in Military points. Oh, okay, so we need to switch this up. Let's go ahead and invest more heavily into... I'm thinking administrative, to be honest. Yeah, because we're just trying to take stuff, you know? We can kick this guy. Go for someone a little bit cheaper to fix my uh, to fix my economy. National, uh, yeah, national tax. Perfect. All right, it's a little bit better. It's a little bit better. And we've raised it up to... Oh, that's great. Oh, that's fantastic. And I'm going for the administrative. Hell yeah. And the extra prestige is nice, too. Now, can they enter through Georgia territory? I'm sure Georgia and, and the Ottomans don't like each other, so I don't think so. Yeah, they're different religions. Um, it's only negative four, but I don't think that's enough. I guess if they start improving it, it'll that can change. All right, Patriots, we, we are waiting for you. We are definitely waiting for you. Also, you know, the Golden Horde might suffer from a lot of attrition here. We might want to... Uh, Maybe after this war, we might want to go after them. 
Or maybe during the war. Who knows? I thought I did discover the Hudson Bay. What the hell? Oh, now this Terra Incognita is gone. Very, very nice. And do we have the, the colonial distance to be able to do this? Technically, I don't. Okay, so it's 345. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. It's still a good idea because now, you know, the Terra Incognita is gone and we can just start to colonize this stuff. But that's, yeah, I thought that. It's a little bit too far away. But with Diplo 9, uh, it will increase my colonial range to what? By 50. Oh, it's not. That's still not going to be enough. Oh, shit. That is, I, if my math is correct, that still won't be enough. Okay, you guys are going to be okay, right? Yeah, they get no leader. Well, that kind of sucks. Who would think? I've got control of Iceland. I still can't colonize. Very easily, I guess. Wow. Well, that kind of is a bummer. It's a huge bummer. Yeah, because because at that point, I'll be at like uh, 275. I'll, 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 just, I'll be just barely under. Uh, what am I doing? I'm using this, the wrong map mode. Um, what am I doing? Yeah. So plus 50... That won't be enough. I'll be at I'll be at 325, 20 away. Ah, I feel like there should be some sort of thing that you like it can cost you to uh, to maybe boost it up. Like sometimes it's, you're so close. Oh gosh, five. Who ganged five in aggressiveness? Oh my gosh. Uh, sometimes I wish you could like pay something, maybe administrative power, or diplo power, whatever it is, to kind of get that extra, you know, a few effective colonial distance. That just sucks. I'm 20 away from being able to colonize uh, Newfoundland. Great job, guys. You guys are doing a fantastic job. I still have a lot to colonize, though. It's it's We're still nowhere any close. And we're going to have to continue to colonize throughout this entire campaign because we're just trying to expand towards lands that are not Catholic. So we're going to be trying to spread Catholicism as much as we can. Now, where are you going to be coming from? Okay, right there in the middle. So we've got someone there ready to go. So we've got some more rebels coming. Uh, even though my national unrest is at negative, almost negative four. Oh, yeah, you'll probably still come. You still have an 11% chance of uprising. I'm thinking about it right now, to be honest. I'm thinking about going to war with these guys. Even though I'm at war with the Ottomans, I'm actually losing this war. Maybe that's a bad idea. Again, I don't think they're going to be able to get to us unless they go through Poland. But if Poland can't handle it, then that would be an issue. And I'm not... No way. I am not going to send anything over there. Absolutely not. But maybe the Ottomans are kind of weak right now. They only have... Yeah, they've got a pretty weak amount of troops, technically... I mean, you have to think that I'm I'm definitely boosting up the the numbers on this side. Yeah, Lithuania is providing thirty three thousand infantry, um, as well as seven thousand cavalry and seventeen thousand uh, artillery. Wow. Okay. Well, yeah, th th these numbers are kind of lopsided, but yeah, actually, you know, Poland's gonna be fine. We can go to war we can we can afford to go to war with the Golden Horde. We could, but do I want to? I want to wait for these patriots to uprise real quick, and then maybe. And also, I'm still far away from... I'm probably going to annex Norway. and Because it, it, there's no point in rushing for Diplo 9, right? Because getting extra 50 is not going to be enough. Colonial range. So, yeah, I guess so. And the next one is not until level 10. Oh, wait. No, no this is trade range. I'm sorry. The next one is until 11. Oh, crap. Well, that sucks. That really sucks. Okay, let's, let's fight these guys. And I think I'm going to go to war. I think we're going to go with the Golden Horde. We, we, I mean, Poland's handling the Ottomans, uh, and I, I don't plan, I don't intend to help them out at all. Okay, continue to explore Africa. Good job. Just good stuff. Very good stuff. Gotten all this stuff out of the way. And uh, let's see. Let's, let's continue to do that here. I cannot I cannot repay, repay the loan yet. Maybe I should wait for the, the, the loan to be finished off. Let's repay the loan first. Yeah, I think, I think I'll do that. Wait for a second. Ugh, I've got it. Oh, no. Come on. Advisor level two. That's kind of crappy. That's really crappy. I still do not have a legal error. Okay, wait a second. What's going on? Do I have a royal marriage up with Poland? Please. T I don't. Okay, well, there you go. That's probably why. Wh who, who else are my allies? Uh, Austria. No, 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 no. Oh, Austria's an ally, yeah, but... Here, let's make sure we get a royal marriage up with these guys. I cannot believe I didn't have one of these. I really hope we get one soon. And, and, and I hope, because we've wasted a few years without these royal marriages. 
I mean, I don't plan on breaking the alliance with Poland or Austria for a very long time. I want to really gain some power because, I mean, aesthetically, this is a little bit... A little bit not true. We, we're a lot weaker than it may look on the surface. Like, it looks like we're really powerful, we've got all this land, but to be honest, this is not that much. This really isn't that much. Jeez, just the longer I go into this, oh gosh. Oh, they didn't take that much at all. Oh, we got so lucky. Okay, how, how long, how much can I, can I, yes! I can, I can fully annex you. It's gonna cost me so much though. That's gonna cost me a lot. I might just have to vassalize Muscovy. Or take a few provinces and then vassalize the rest. Okay, well, I can I can now take them out fully. So that's a start. Uh, oh, now you guys are out here. Okay, that's fine. Okay, and then we'll go right there. We'll fix the uh, military leaders died. Damn it, we were just about to go to war too. I am not going to improve this at all. Um, I have enough, almost enough for a nice little papacy bonus. Damn, why'd that military leader just die right now? Oh, no, 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 that was the explorer. Oh, okay, okay, okay. You know what? We don't need him anymore. Yeah, we don't need him anymore. That's fine. And yes, I'll get the military power. Perfect. Oh, good. It wasn't the two-star general. We got lucky. Because we actually don't need the explorer anymore. We've already discovered the new, the, the new world, so we're good to go. Awesome. Okay, that works out for us. And I don't know when we're... Oh, there we go. Spy offense. Perfect. Okay, so 756, not bad, but obviously not the best either. We, I hope, I really hope we get a really good error. I really, really, really hope that we get a really good error. So, myself, right now, I'm only allied to Austria and Poland. I mean, obviously that's enough. It would like, it'd be nice to get up another royal marriage. Actually, you know what, with Norway. That might help, yeah. There we go, with Norway. And we'll stop improving. Okay, we've got three royal marriages up. We better get a damn error soon. Even though it's a little bit sketchy, I could get into the wrong line. But no one's going to be able to take us over. We should be fine. Okay. Uh, damn it, I'm at war, so I cannot begin to... Can I peace out uh, the Ottomans yet? I can. It's probably going to make Poland not too happy, though. I don't know how... Oh, he is... He is taking a lot of power from... You know what? I don't care. We're out of here. Yeah, we're out of here. Boom, send demand. It's fine. You're probably not going to like that too much. Yeah, it's fine. It's only 20. You're, you're, you're good, Poland. It's fine. Okay, so let's annex you. Get you out of the way. We do not... Okay, now I can kind of lower my army mates to a point where I can get a little bit more money. There we go. 10 ducats a month should be good enough. Are, are these... Damn, these colonies have taken forever. Also, these colonies are, are going to be finished up as well. So... Oh, well, you know what? Should I get a, uh, a... Like a conquistador? A conquistador? I, I probably need to. I, I, yeah, I, I kind of need to right now. Because I, I've got... I want to continue to go off this way. Even though this land isn't that powerful, not that high of base tax, not that, mon not, not, not that much manpower, I still want to continue to expand my empire out this way, but if I need the money, then I need the money. There's nothing else I can really do about it. September. Uh-oh. Are we going to make it? Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. Our manpower is at 92,000. 50% chance we're getting unrest. Yeah, let's go with that. That's fine. If unrest happens, then unrest happens. Because we're good now. Yeah. Yeah, we've, we've stabled out. Perfect. Okay, so now everything's good to go. We're ready to go back into wars, and I don't know if I want to go to war with Muscovy or Sweden. How long is the Golden Hordes uh, truce up? Till 1556. Well, we're, we're going to want to go to war with Muscovy before 1556. That is for sure. I don't think I want the extra colonist. I think I want to invest... Well, wait a second. The colonist would be for... This would cost me administrative power. Oh, we've got... Ugh. But my economy really can't sustain that many colonists right now, so that's... I'm kind of thinking about it. Ah, that, I'm kind of thinking about it. Economically, mm, we're, st we're at zero. We're, 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 we're doing fine. We are doing fine. It's only, yeah, fuck it. Fuck it. Come on, let's do it. Let's do it. We'll, we'll start colonizing fast, really fast in the east. Um, yeah, we're going to colonize really fast in the east. And then by that point, whenever we do get the distance, we can start to colonize Newfoundland and stuff like that. Okay perfect and you can kind of come up and support these guys oh shit we actually probably won't win that 
Oh, my colony's been damaged. Oh my gosh, no way. It's gone? Oh, that sucks. Dang, that sucks. Well, we're getting a lot of money back, and before I end this one, I'm going to repay the loan. Oh, that sucks. I mean, this still had about halfway to go, but damn, that... That is really, really sad. That was... That's unfortunate. Okay, we'll boost this back up. Crap. <laughs> I don't even know what to say about that one. That's just... Here, stay here for now for a second so you can regain your morale back a bit. A bit. All right, guys, I'm about to stop right there. Dang. Well, that sucks, but, you know, we've got other things, a lot of other things going for us. Really a lot of other things going for us. Again, just trying to work on my, my borders right now. So terrible. My font is not as good. It was looking good for a while there. My font was looking really good for a while there, and now it's just kind of started to be crappy again. Okay, make sure you guys get there. Alright, and that's about it. Alright guys, I'm about to stop right there. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.